Hi, my name is Travis Torme. I'm a criminal defense lawyer in New Jersey. This video is about marijuana offenses, other drug charges, and how I defend against these cases. Today I'm going to talk to you about challenging the actual possession of marijuana. Many times in these cases, there are several individuals in a vehicle or at a home and multiple defendants are charged with possession of the same marijuana. The state has to prove beyond a reasonable doubt that you were in possession of marijuana. Now, there is a presumption in a motor vehicle if four individuals are in a motor vehicle and marijuana is in the center console or in the back seat under the seat, it is presumed that they are all in possession of the marijuana. That is a presumption that we would have to overcome. However, many times if one individual owns up to the marijuana as being in possession, we can get the charges dismissed against you entirely. Now, if the situation involves a house, a porch, or potentially a party being raided, it's a completely different scenario. If you were in another room and the marijuana was in the basement and they charge you with possession of marijuana, they're gonna have a very hard time proving that you were in possession of that marijuana. Now, even if you're the person who owned up to the marijuana as being yours, that doesn't mean your case is over. They still have to prove that whatever you were in possession of was actually marijuana. They have to send it to the state police lab for testing. They have to provide me with the chain of custody reports showing that the marijuana wasn't contaminated from the station to the lab, things of that nature. And even in a worst case scenario, you may be eligible for a diversionary program where we can keep your record clean. If you wanna hear about the other four ways I typically challenge a marijuana case in New Jersey, or you wanna hear about the two diversionary programs you may be eligible for, click the links below. They're all properly labeled so you know where you're going. Also, you may wanna contact me directly on my website. It's criminallawyerinnj.com. My contact information is there, my email is there. Feel free to email me, call me. I'm available 24 hours. I'm happy to give you my opinion on your case.